up in your bank just for recreation, dedication, hard work, plus patience. What's going on YouTube? This your boy Herkberg coming back at you with another video. Today we are actually going to be using the Mini GS and doing a shooting video comparing the Boom Treated Freak uh, Barrel Kit compared to the actual stock barrel that the gun come with. So let's get into the video. So right now we are actually going to be shooting out uh, the Vulcan Graffiti Boys, which are right here. They are uh, high grade paint. So. Very expensive yesterday. Um, <clears throat> we got the stock barrel 0.688 with the die LTR hopper and the Ninja 68 4500 PSI tank. So, that's further ado. Let's go ahead and get into it. I honestly feel like the Ninja, I mean, I'm sorry, the Freak barrel is actually quieter than the stock barrel, and also it also allows less ball chops. So let's go ahead and try it out. All right, so right there, we had two ball chops so far. Um, so right there, we had two ball chops with the stock barrel. And now we're gonna actually see how the freak barrel actually do. Um, with the ball chops and the quietness of the actual barrel itself. So, be right back with that. So, like I said, the ball chopping. So, as you can see, it's a lot of ball chopping inside the barrel. Let me turn it that way just a little bit so y'all can see the actual paint. So, again, the stock barrel is good, but it's best to actually get you a freak barrel. No, we'll just, like again, we'll actually show the difference in that. But yeah, we had a couple of ball chops um, in this in the stock barrel. So now I'm about to change it out and um, go to the Boom Treated Freak uh, XL. All right, so now I have traded out for the Freak XL. Uh, this is a it has a six a point six eight two uh, Freak insert. Um, so now here, still running with it with the uh, still running the die LTR hopper in the same tank. So, right now, we had uh, I think it might be a little bit less than a thousand uh, PSI left in the tank. So, let's see, put this over here, and y'all, y'all decide which one is quieter or which one is accurate if y'all able to see the boss curving. Out of air, but I got another tank. With the uh, I had to go change out the tank, ran out of air. So let's go ahead and see which one shoot quieter and accurate or not accuracy, but uh, the quietest and see how many ball chops we actually get with it. Uh, we didn't have any ball chops with the Freak XL. Uh, as again, this is the Freak XL uh, boom treated barrel with the 0.682 uh, uh, insert. So, yeah, that's pretty much it, man. Y'all decide which one was lighter, or even if it was the same, you know. And let me know if y'all rather choose the stock barrel that they come with to run with, or if y'all rather decide to go with the Freak kit. I took the barrel off the gun. Uh, it's a little paint in there from probably from when it broke with the stock barrel. But as you can see, there was like I said, it wasn't no ball chops, man. Now, going back to the actual stock barrel, as you can see, you can see all that. Oh, I dropped the barrel. As you can see, I um, 
with the stock barrel again this is a 0.688 it was a lot of ball chops uh it actually looked like it was more than two balls i'm not quite sure but we definitely had a ball chop or two so yeah so yeah, I re honestly I recommend going with the uh, the Freak XL kit. Uh, you have other inserts with it that you can choose that you're liking. Um, so yeah, again, it wasn't really any ball chops. Actually, it was none, none ball, no ball chops at all. So I definitely recommend running. If you're running the GS, get you a Freak kit. I'll put the link in the description below. Uh, and then you can take it to uh, Longwood Paintball if you live in Michigan or take it to your local uh, paintball. So that basically concludes our shooting video of the Mini GS. Again, we ran with the LTR by Die. And right now for the last portion of the video, we ended up going with the HK Army. Uh, this is actually a 3000 uh, tank, HPA tank. So, all right, man. Please like, share, subscribe, and we'll get back at you for another video.